Josh, we know that, you know, with all eyes, of course, on the president's infrastructure plan, people have also been focused on the priority that he has now in nominating a new justice to the Supreme Court. Has the president really given any further indication as to who, in fact, he's considering? Morgan, the White House now confirming that Judge J. Michelle Childs is on the list. She's a federal judge in South Carolina who's supported by a close Biden ally, House Majority Whip James Clyburn. President Biden has already nominated Judge Childs for the appeals court, and she had a Senate confirmation hearing scheduled for this week. Now the White House says they'll postpone that hearing while Childs is being considered for the Supreme Court. Now, the president's shortlist is also believed to include Judge Katanji Brown Jackson, a former law clerk for retirement. Retiring Justice Stephen Breyer and California Supreme Court Justice Leandra Kruger. But a White House spokesman tells me those aren't the only three candidates that the president is considering. And President Biden has said he'll announce his decision by the end of February. Morgan? For a historic nomination. All right, Josh Letterman for us there outside the White House. Josh, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.